what is up my coconut bras and welcome back and in this video we're going to be breaking down the latest match that just happened between the pro league teams playing ducks and team vitality now they had some amazing plays on both sides of them with some really really crazy clutches just from each individual player but basically what we're going to be doing in this video is taking some highlights of clips lines of sights and just overall pro tactics that they were using that helped them get some advantages over the other team now this first one is going to be for when people are defending the tea room what generally is going to be happening is a lot of top players will be using a mirror on the second to left hand wall from the tea room this way they'll be able to look and pre-fire the stairs and other doors while their teammates watch their right and a great way they countered this was they sent an ash over here this would also work with buck too if they wanted to and you basically take out the four below them and as you saw in the clip that just forced them to move back at these desks Alex sees angle. him and wins the fight Zeronic will fall just taking a bit of damage and they need to find them and clear them out. Alem is behind that desk and they do have the hole made above the floor but he didn't quite see him through it and allows him to up and run away. Deeper in, sees him now, gets the shots off and will secure that kill. 2v2 then and minute 15 to go. Alright, this next spot is going to be how to counter the very popular defensing area in the restaurant and downstairs generally when people are defending the barbecue area. And as a defender from this angle, it just opens up so many different lines of sight. And the way they were able to counter this was by sending a buck to the upstairs floor in T room where the floor is completely destructible and opening up specific spots where they believe the defender was. And from here, as you see right there, the table is taken out. Now he turned a little bit because it forced him to move, but that's not a problem because as you see right here, the entire floor, you were able to take out and see the entire restaurant area. Fight and get those kills where and where needed. Right, and the, that is a nice angle coming out from Zyronic. The smallest possible hole, but gives you full visibility on the Geisha window. That's fantastic. He's going to be able to support his bandit so well via that. But uh, yeah, no. Now this next one, they just had a small glimpse of it and I absolutely love this line of sight. I've never seen this before and basically all they did was as a defender, you just are going to poke a tiny little hole in the bottom left hand corner and from this line of sight, you're going to be able to watch and protect this main window entrance and this is just such a common area to be attacking from when you're defending tea room upstairs and as you see right here as an attacker, this is what it's going to look like. So very, very nice line of sight and if you blinked you might have missed it because it was just a small glimpse and I was very glad I was able to catch well, that one. There is Zyronic playing all the way on what I'm, I'm not sure West Tower I guess it's called never seen this position used before playing all the way on West Tower to try and establish a line of sight onto CCTV to mess with Rise's roam in the stud site. Panix is in there too and they do know this the drones have been in and have spotted both roamers in there so now it's a case of trying to figure them out this is an angle all the way to the east stairs too you can see and he is looking straight down through the center of the map from this spot. But now they have to deal with panics and rise in those corners. Yes, they've got them in there. They've located them and they've sort of pinned them here with Glaz's position. But Alright, now this next one is going to be a glass line of sight on the map border and this is not used very much. This is the outside ladder scaffolding area and basically what they were using this for was to basically help take control of CCTV room by attempting to cut through the path of roamers that might be inside of this room. Now you can even shoot this little wall right here and see all the way back. So very, very nice line of sight. He wasn't able to get any kills but it was able to change up the game a little bit. Someone around there and a small one through to waiting room now as well. LM's picked off, went ranged by Renewals all the way from the metal staircase through this tiny hole in the wall. Beautiful angle and Renewals makes him pay for it. Rise now inside the passport office, does have Snooken's holes in the wall behind him to contend with. So Look. can't quite see him through them yet and Rise has managed to sneak his way past it. This is the stuff from Playing Ducks that they were talking about, these little pocket stress. I guess you could say really just angles they have been using to their advantage very well so far in this matchup. Now, I absolutely love this line of sight from the Playing Ducks, and they were using just such great teamwork in order for him not to get flanked, and they were able to use this small little murder hole to watch from the bottom of the metal staircase all the way into the teller's office just through a tiny little hole, even smaller than the one that you see on screen right here, just kind of making it big for the example. And as you see right here, he was able to hold such a tight line of sight through the little crack in the red pole and another little thing that you can do is come all the way back into the supply room and hold the same angle from even further back. 
So a really, really nice spot by the playing Doesn't ducks. do anything serious here to Revan's position. He's looking for the mirror window. If he can get that canister open, that will change this up drastically. But will Revan still be alive at that point, or will Zoronix still be alive? There we go, the hatch is open. Beefy has moved across. The smoke is close. Sorry, enemy, the smoke is close now. 30 seconds to go. Playing ducks have to commit to this. Looks for Revan. Beautiful pick from Zeronic. Will he fall down to smoke though? Enemy is just using the smoke charges. 20 seconds to go. He doesn't have to peek this. The smoke's going on through. Enemy is looking to come on into the room. Zeronic is right by the window. Sees him stand up. All right, you guys. And this next one is going to be an absolutely sick way how to counter Miras. And this one specifically was used in the armory. This works on other maps too. But basically what they did was they sent their Blackbeard downstairs and they found the line of sight in order to shoot up and take out the canister on the wall and when they did that they were able to send their glass player in and make an incredible push it's really crazy though because they ended up losing that round to one of the best clutches in the game have that clip at the end if you want to see it that's for sure yeah it's been a close call either way so enemy up on the bookshelf has to worry about the glass shots coming in through the door in a moment to drop on off to the safer side all right, you guys, and moving on, we have another badass glass line of sight on border that is used a lot in Pro League, and this one's really crazy. All you have to do is be back here in the vehicle entrance spawn and come to this location. You will be able to shoot through, go through the office, all the way in towards the armory area, and this one's really good. As you saw in the clip, he just did a quick check to see if this wall was reinforced, because if it's not reinforced, there's going to be massive holes in right here, and as you see, especially with Glass News thermal scope you are going to be able to see crazy deep into the spawn all right now that's going to pretty much wrap it up for this video i hope you guys all have an awesome weekend i'll see you guys all very soon got another really short clip of the crazy 1v3 clutch i hope you guys like it see you all very soon we have so much stuff planned and here's a small quick clip of me getting an actual kill of it in matchmaking check out the links down below see you guys all very soon let me know if you guys want me to do more of these pro league videos love you all peace up and it's a good kill but they will trade it back with the lems lackey however is off the diffuser renewals is there a lems gets a second can he go for the third oh, he's down him and lems with a 3k put vitality up three rounds to two uh, well, okay, Plain Ducks won that round, and then Alems decided that they didn't win that round. They just, he was just kind of like, oh, you know, I'm going to get a 3k at, casually at the end here with one magazine. That was fantastic play from Alems, putting his team back into the lead 3-2. Oh, boy.